I am not so much of a Hello Kitty. <laughs> Aloha guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I just have a little random new in haul for you guys today and it's not going to be as long it's just a couple of things that I wanted to share with you guys before I start wearing them if I haven't wore it already if you guys are not familiar with this channel my name is Rochelle I love luxury high bay things so if that is up your alley why not consider subscribing and help your girl out this won't be a long video again I'm just sharing with you guys some just really random things that I got recently and I want to wear it it, so I'm going to show it to you guys in no particular order okay I've been having some really great Target runs lately and I'm just pretty shocked by the things that I had found there I usually just go there to get you know really small random things um, and Millie's treats and toys and stuff so I I'm a black pink stan so of course I had to get their born pink album of course I'm not one of those people who buy multiple to get them all um, so I was very excited that um, the one that I got was main was mainly Jisoo she is definitely, I mean, they're all my favorites, but how cute because you get like little like Polaroid styled things. And then I got one of Lisa, Jenny, and what I mean that it's a Jisoo styled box is you'll get more of her things, which I'm happy with. So I got that. And you know it's really random. Um, I buy these CDs and like I don't have any CD players in my um, cars. Well one of them it doesn't really play but that's like a, an older vehicle that I have. And my newer vehicle I there's no CD player. So I just bought it because I'm a fan. Huh. And um, I did buy... I don't know if you know this as well, but Target does have Levi's there. I'm a huge fan of Levi's as somebody who used to work for the brand. Uh, still am a fan, so I bought... I'm wearing them now, so I can't share them for, with you, but I'll insert a picture here. And these are the rib cage jeans. It has stretch in them, and I love them. I have been wearing them non-stop since I got them, which is only just a few days ago. But I love them. I'm about to go and buy more. But I can't wait because the store is reopening back up in my local mall. So I can't wait to see what the selection is like when they open back up. But another thing is, you know, on this channel, we love a great adult Lego set. And I um, finally found the succulent set when they came out it came out with the orchid set and you've seen me build that one i built two since then and um this took second precedence to that so i finally built this and i finally had the chance to catch up on my lego building i finally just built the second orchid that i wanted i have one i have different ones in different rooms and i also finished my starry night van gogh and just finished the succulent something small from Louis Vuitton if you didn't already know and you are a fan of Louis Vuitton's agendas the 2023 agenda refills has launched recently and this is one I would say act fast because they don't keep these in production for long especially if you don't have a size that's the most common so most common sizes that um you would usually see restock in is probably the inserts for the medium and the mm and the pm set with the rings um for this one which i have the medium i have the pm and i have the desk agenda this is one that you will more likely not see so 
try to get yours as soon as possible um, because they're gonna sell out quickly throughout the company and yes I know this as an old employee I definitely know that okay so this is the stickers this year and I haven't had the chance to go through it yet um but it's it's pretty like this type of art pretty cute I mean pretty standard for Louis Vuitton to be honest they look the weeks look like this has a turtle with the dummy shell in the front um though gone are the days where they had that beefed up pack that came with more things um it's probably because they didn't sell as well so again if you are a agenda girl find them now so these shoes here aren't really something that was on my radar i just one day couldn't sleep was on the sneakers app and i won the raffle for these or however you whatever nike calls it so i got these pecan dunk highs and i really loved it because of the brown i don't feel like i have something in this type of brown and i love that it comes with these blue shoelaces i think the proper name for these blue is called sail warm blue and the brown is called pecan it does come with the i apologize for the noise but it does come with the extra set of brown laces to match I do love the blue on it but I am more likely going to do it with the brown because that's what I was looking for for I was looking mainly more for an all brown heavy shoe so as much as I love it with the blue I'm going to more than likely stitch it with the brown but I was excited to win this I just I think they're cute haven't bought shoes in a while I can't even remember the last time I did buy a pair of sneakers. Another sneaker which bamboozled me to get because this was something I just thought was cute. I didn't really think I needed it because I'm not so much of a Hello Kitty fan. I think she's adorable, don't get me wrong. I'm more of a San X, Rilakkuma, Retsuko fan. However, I'll show you what really got me on these. And I got these for retail. Nike did a restock on these, so I was super excited. And I was like, you know what? For retail, I'll buy them at retail. So how cute though, if you look at the tissue. The tissue is uh, Hello Kitty. And ta -da, I got the Hello Kitty Prestos. And really, the one reason why I wanted it is because look at how cute. This is the back tab of the shoe. And Prestos, so I bought these and the sizes that were available on the restock was actually one size bigger than I really truly am but because I have no preference in size I am of a height where I can pull off to a pretty big size um, I was like you know what let's try it. I have not tried them on yet so I'm planning to wear them today I am going to pick up I have a dress that I need to pick up at Nordstrom today they only have it on hold for a couple days did you know that do you know that if you buy something from Nordstrom's website and you get it delivered to the location you're at that you only have a few days to pick it up didn't know that either so I have to go and pick it up today luckily I'm feeling much better today sorry just to throw off this new in haul I actually had I want to call it like a sinus attack because this whole area here was extremely swollen and painful when i blinked my it really hurt it, like if you touched it here it hurt really bad and it was pretty swollen so it's now at a place where it's not so swollen so i was able to um do eye makeup again i don't do eye makeup all often and honestly i think the reason why i got swollen was because it's around the time i started putting on eye makeup again and it must have just bothered my eyes so heavily so hopefully today I didn't use any like uh, 
I usually cat eye, didn't cat eye today, just used mascara and anything to avoid touching the insides of my eyes, I avoided that. But I digress, I apologize. But these, hopefully they're not too big because, ah, hopefully they're not too big because I plan on wearing them today. They also have these really cute little Hello Kitty bows, but really this is what sold it to ya girl can't wait to wear them today uh the one thing though i'm gonna um, be honest with you that i was a little disappointed about is while i was looking at them you see how the dots on here on the painting on the dots it looks so much more cleaner than on the left side deeply annoyed deeply annoyed But anywho's guys, that is it for the new in haul. I am going to the mall literally in the next like 10 minutes because we haven't eaten yet. We had a light breakfast this morning. So I am down to eat some lunch. And um, I honestly am just excited to get out of the house because the only time I left the last couple days was to drive and get food. Um, I'm just excited to go out because it technically as of last Friday, today is Monday, I have been on vacation. I'm a little bit saddened at the fact that our trip got canceled. Um, I don't want to rehash that, so we will not talk about that. So I'm not going anywhere for this year, but I'm hoping in 2023 things change and I'm able to finally leave after not going anywhere throughout this whole pandemic. Um, let's cross fingers. But anyways, guys, that is it for this really short haul. I always appreciate you guys for checking me out. And again, if you guys have not subscribed, why not help your girl out? And that is it. Like this as well. You guys are always the LS 